Guys, do you know that only 4500 non-engineers are able to score above 90 percentile in CAT exam? Yes, we are not talking about 99 percentile, we are just talking about 90 percentile. And out of this 4500 non-engineers, only 2300 non-engineers are actually able to clear this sectional cutoffs for the top B school, which is about 80 percentile in each section. Yes, so in case if you are pressurizing yourself by constantly thinking about that 95 or 99 percentile, this video is going to be like a wake-up call. So please watch this video till the end to get the useful insights and information about uh, the CAT takers in terms of the performance of engineers and non-engineers. Uh, this will definitely help you setting the right targets for yourself. Along with my team could access the complete information of all the students in last two years who have appeared for CAT exam. We analyzed this information, we did some detailed number crunching to come up with this useful information for all of you. So let's begin and look at that. So we already know how many students registered for CAT exam and how many actually appear for CAT exam. In fact, I have displayed the same data once again, which I had shown in my previous video. The link for that has been provided in the description. In this chart, so, uh, the bottom figures indicates the number of candidates having uh, you know, above 90 and above 18, 10, 10, 12. Now let's understand how many of the total CAT takers are male and female because many colleges give extra points to female candidate. And once you will uh, look at these numbers that I have displayed on the screen you will realize that why they give this extra points to the female candidate so as you can see on your screen uh, the female candidates are almost half the male candidate so let's bifurcate this males and females based on their educational background so as you can see on your screen the total engineers are almost 50% in terms of numbers out of 191,000 uh, CAT takers almost 96,500 are engineers and out of this 96,500 engineers the male engineers are 72,000 and that is the reason why you have seen that most of the general engineer male are worried about their GEM tech but don't worry every cloud has a silver lining so I'll share some uh, really interesting sets in the uh, next few slides and uh, you will not be worried much about that afterwards also don't forget that 50% uh, are non-engineers so the competition for engineers and non-engineers are almost same now let's see how many of these candidates are actually able to clear the overall cutoffs and sectional cutoffs for top B schools as you know that in CAD exam top 1% of the candidates are able to get 99 plus percentile so out of 191,000 candidates almost 1910 candidates would be getting around 99 plus percentile so as displayed on your screen out of this 1900 candidates uh, about 1610 are uh, engineers and remaining are non-engineers now let's understand how many of this 1910 candidates that is top one percentile that is those who have got 99 plus percentile are actually able to clear the sectional cutoff and you'll be surprised to see that almost 200 candidates are missing out on the sectional cutoff even after scoring um, you know 99 plus percentile in CAT exam almost 200 candidates are not able to score uh, more than 80 percentile in at least one section and they miss out on the top B school criteria so this is where you need to be cautious that if you are scoring 99 uh, plus percentile make sure that you are uh, uh, distributing your efforts and you are clearing sectional cutoff for each B school similarly on your screen i have displayed data about the number of candidates scoring above 90 percentile in cat exam along with uh, you know scoring above 80 percentile in each section and uh, as you can see only 4500 non-engineers are able to score above 90 percentile in cat exam yes that's correct out of uh, almost 50 percent of the non-engineers right uh, only 4500 are able to score above 90 percentile in cat exam and out of them only 2300 are able to clear the sectional cutoffs of top b school which we are considering as 80 percentile so uh, this is what i wanted to tell you that uh, what you should be more worried about about scoring 99 percentile or about uh, about scoring just 90 plus percentile yes so your guess is correct of course uh, you can also mention your thoughts in the chat box but my suggestion is that first think about uh, how to score above 90 percentile set your target as 90 percentile because the data are in front of you here is the wake up call for all the non-engineers it's okay if you are not able to score above 99 percentile even if you are able to score above 90 percentile 
trust me you will open up plenty of good b schools options for yourself assuming that you have performed equally well in all the sections so i hope you would have enjoyed this video you would have found it useful please uh, don't forget to hit the like button and please share it with all your friends and check the description as i mentioned at the beginning stay tuned